In Marriage and Money, we won't name names, but a couple of popular TV anchors are capturing the nation's attention after falling for each other while on the job and while in reportedly struggling marriages to other people. Top divorce attorney Gemma Allen gets to the heart of the matter about flirting at work. Hi, I'm Gemma Allen. Statistically, there is a high probability of workplace romance. About one third of employees surveyed in 2021 answered that they were or had been involved with a coworker. Before and after COVID, we spend more waking hours with coworkers than anyone else. The problem is that these relationships are potential career killers. Currently, two prominent TV personalities both have been taken off the air for their romantic choices. Why the concerns? When people are in love, they're distracted and they're distracting. Air changes around them, everyone speculates, and no one is as productive. If there's a breakup, everyone suffers too. Lovers, coworkers, and likely customers, along with the bottom line. And there are or should be HR procedures to be followed that frequently were not, which puts everyone in jeopardy. Workplace issues can include favoritism, harassment, and even violence. Risky business, indeed. Before you take one flirty step forward, consult your HR department. Who should you inform and how, when, and even then, what happens if you break up? And if you or your love interest or both are already married, you know you're living dangerously. The heart may have its reasons for which there is no reason, but at work, you must behave reasonably. I'm Gemma Allen. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Go to businessfirstam.com for where to see our show on TV.